All right. You see that? Okay. Yeah. There was a lady in with the fucking what's his face. Yeah. In that. What? All right. Yeah. Hi, everyone. Welcome back to Amandia playing Boku no Natsu Yasumi 2. Adventure by the Sea. It's me, Dia. M, say hi. Hello. Hello. We have so, to get off the screen. It's like deafening the screen. Only it, the screen, really. It's it's quiet over here. Or it's like oh, quiet. Oh. I guess it, it can't. I, yeah, I, can't I, I wouldn't say it's like actually deafening, but it's just loud. It's very loud. I relative. I have to get off it because otherwise we'll, we'll get we'll get comments on YouTube going. Oh, their mix is wrong. Um. Okay. Playtime. Three hours and twenty four minutes. We're three days into thirty. So yeah. there we go. All right. The internet was like, "Oh, this is like a fifteen hour game." I don't. I don't think that's true. I think that's a fucking lie. I think we're gonna be doing this forever. Yeah, I don't. <laughs> I mean, who knows? Oh, also, we're playing on slow, so this is a little self inflicted. It's true. And once again, we did not miss morning calisthenics. Hell yeah. When I was taking Japanese in high school, um, because it had to sync, we were like a, a, a telecommuting class mm -hmm. and we had to sync up all the classes. So we did just get it there. Um, or we didn't have homeroom. We just had Japanese class first thing in the morning. Um, but it always began with 15 minutes morning calisthenics. Oh, nice. I just want to show up in the morning to be up with ice cream. あれ?どうしたの? うちの妹、光って言うんだ。よろしくね。うん、知ってるよ。もう何度かお話ししたもん。なんだ。そうなの。私男の子って大嫌いなんだ。え?なんでだって男んちの男の子いつも光に意地悪ばっかしてくんだ
なんでおみくじなのかな<笑>さあなぜでしょう本人に聞いてみたらいいかもね All right, let's ask. Yeah. Cursed oh, fortune. damn. We're gonna die. Well, All right, well, I guess let's go follow her and hope nothing bad happens to us. Yeah,やっぱり森の近くに来ると空気がしっとりしてて美味しいな。そうかな。キノコみたいなカビ臭い匂いもするけど。ね、お墓の三秒ルールって知ってる？ <laughs> え、どういうことこの石段の上にお墓があるのだからこの広場は息を止めて三秒以内で駆け抜けなくちゃいけないんだへえそうなんだうんじゃあ息を吸ってうんいくぞ<笑><笑> Go after her Oh <laughs> お姉ちゃん本気で走ったの久しぶりだったよ。Girl, it was three seconds. 今のは賭け子だったんだ。じゃあ僕だって負けないよ。あ、これこれそっちはダメだって。Are we gonna meet the weird guy? 私、リーズだな、シェイ。いや。誰もいないのかな。どうしたの?実はね。ここ。私が家に行くのに、そんな私の家なの。そうなんだ。今はもう全く付き合いがないんだけど。私が小学校に上がるまではほとんど毎日一
お姉ちゃんは話題の主が帰ってくる前にお地蔵様まで戻ってるからねオッケー A lot of drama for being,、uh, I guess I don't, because she said she was like one, she coming back from college, but I assume she means like a, if that kid's a middle schooler and he's one year younger than her, I assume she's in high school. Yeah,、right? it's, it's, I was just very confused by that myself. I was like, wait a minute, <laughs> why is he a middle schooler? Uh, let's go meet with her. Yeah. Because there's not shit to do over here. We've already done it. I don't know, man. She's full of drama. Oh, yeah, she was the president. <laughs> president of drama. Her dad's dead. She lives in a greenhouse. She's and, hanging you know, out with the you know, third grader all summer. Yeah, she's like a weird art kid, but they haven't really invented art kids yet. So her sister's going to be a goth, but they really haven't invented goths yet. <laughs> God, she is. It's like a little proto Wednesday Adams. Um. Oh, I guess. Where did she say she was going? Jesus statues. Oh, Jesus statues. That's right. Yeah. Oh, it's the creepy guy. Oh, hey, Simon. Heheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheh
Oh, we already grabbed one. Yeah, bro, we know this. ちょ、今日は来てないみたいだな。いつもここにザリガニがいるの?僕。こんなとこでも結構いるんだ。他の場所でもとにかく蓋をめくってみることだね。ねえ、そこの家って。ああ、それは大人が廃屋って言ってる
I want to beat your little brother at sumo. Sumo time. All right. Cage. Yeah. There's the big one. Yeah. To the right. Right. Yeah. Place bug. Oh, yeah. We're going to crush you. 39 millimeters? Got this. Uh, yeah. So maybe we can. So we should poke it. Because he poked his like a couple times. Because I think it makes it mad and then it probably fights better, be my guess. Okay, we'll poke it twice. Okay. Oh, you have to redo it. Whatever you did, you're right. Yeah. yeah. Fight. Yes, he did. Fuck him up. Yes, what? Uh, wow. I mean, this is the older boy, right? He's just better at this. Damn. Face strike. I didn't no, even know they oh. could do face strike. Yeah. One L. Yeah, man. Try it again. So it was good. Oh, well, let me. Oh, can we only fight with one bug a day? I think we can only fight the bug one time a day, maybe. Well, let's see if we can use one of the other bugs. Yeah. All right, let's let's go. We got we got Wakamoto Haru here. Oh, no. We're gonna get a hand on this one of these days. What did you do? I don't know. Come on. You just hit you hit, hit circle on the bug. Yeah, I know. Circle. Let's go. There we go. And you have to take him. Yeah. Okay. Uh. Well, let's go, I guess. Yeah, let's go. Yes, he did. Come on, face strike. Oh, no. We're oh, he's got, like, those. double stamina bars. Yeah. Damn. Victory by stamina. His stamina goes up every time he wins also. It's like it's getting longer. <laughs> it's going to piss off his, his bug. And now your bug's all stressed out, right? Fight, fight the glacial Apollo against his, his bug. Fine, you know what? I'm just not going to poke it. I'm going to see what it does. Okay. Let's go. Yeah, wear it down. Oh. No, oh, come on. Wear it down. You got this. You got this. Stress it out. Oh, did it quit? Come on. Come on. You got this. Here, he just has too much stamina. Oh. Oh. Ah. Yeah. Okay. Well then. You know, I mean, today was... I, I checked the guide. The guide's like, get one that says big. So we just need a bigger we bug. <laughs> We, just, we need to talk Keisha one. You know, today was honestly a kind of a, a day full of upsets with, with Sumo, you know. Um, uh, like, all the Ozeki except for, for Takakesha lost. Takakesha was the only one who came back from shoulder injury. He's just a big meatball hamster. So, you know. the Yokozuna, I think. I think, yeah. Yeah. Uh, he lost, too. So, you know, today's just a day of, of, of upsets in Sumo. That's all. That happens sometimes. Um, what do you want to do? Um, God, uh, let's go hang out at the hospital. Okay, that sounds like fun. That's across the river back here, right? I know the other way. Uh, go forward. Is it? Oh. Oh wait. 
Cat sleeping. <laughs> Did I ever show you the picture of the cat that followed me and Sarah all around the Pet uh, Cemetery north, north, in North? In France. No. No, you did not. <laughs> There's this cat that followed us. Around. Right. Um, right. The I'm, other right. I'm getting there. I'm getting there. <laughs> Look, this little kid's got tank controls. Let's go. So, yeah, fuck those kids. We don't care about them. North and then north again. Okay, yeah. And then up over the hill, past this house, to the clinic. Do we have a dog? We'll see you later. There we go. Sick. All right, let's poke around, see if anyone's here. Yeah, we're the weird nerd kid that's kids showing up at the, the hospital to hang out. I heard you guys were bored. I mean, yeah. Tatoeba,口当たりがいいからって、そうめんや冷や麦みたいな炭水化物ばかり食べてちゃいけませんよ。そうなんだ。炭水化物をエネルギーとして燃やすのに必要なビタミン へえ、そのビタミンなんとかは何に入ってるのビタミンビーグンは豚肉とかうなぎ、ごまなんかに多く含まれている栄養素なのだから夏にはうなぎっていうのはちゃんと根拠があるのよ。へえ、そのビタミ
I just figured eventually someone's going to be in the clinic. Yeah, that's us. So there's a bee's nest. Yeah. Well, Let's not worry about that. I uh, check the tree while we're over here. Because we really want a big beetle. Yeah. Kick it a couple times. Are it? Yeah. yeah. Let's get big. Up. Oh. It's oh. a new bug, but it's really small. Yeah. We'll keep it just because we don't have one. Yeah. Maybe the stag beetles are just smaller. I don't know. It's possible. Because that's significantly smaller. Yes. Um, what's north? I don't remember what's north versus south here. Yeah. Oh, there's this cool thing. Oh, right. The empty beach. Yeah. Over this way? No. Oh, wait. It's a run down boat. Okay. Let me go diving. Yeah, we could. Sploosh. Oh, you hit the wrong button. Yeah. Oh, wait, we got to, we got to try adjusting our tackle here. Oh, yeah, sure. I want to lose our crayfish, even though it's probably better bait. No, it's, it's our homie. Anyone biting? Down like blood worms? My stepfather used to keep blood worm, live blood worms to feed his uh, fish in his aquarium. And, oh, let's, let's go. Yo, <laughs> we caught a marbled soul. It's a big fucking fish. That's a big fish. Hell yeah. Let me try one more time. Or actually, let's just go diving. Okay. Alright. Well, let's see if I can find some uh, bottle caps or something. Yeah. Or sea creatures. Either one. So we just keep going? Is there like a boundary? That's what I was trying to, I was kind of wondering about. Oh, look at this all cool yeah. shit. Let's go, we'll go down from here. I want to see what's down there. Cause look, there's a little tide pool, little yeah. area. Okay. Mm. All right, take a breath, kid. Cause we already found the rocket nozzle down here. Yeah. Once we meet that guy, we can give it to him. This area is really big. Yeah. Should probably head up. <laughs> we barely made it last time. Yeah. Um. Keep going. No. Uh, go. Uh, go right. I want to see. Oh, there's, there's a waterfall. Any, like, caves or cool shit. Yeah. Secrets behind the waterfall. Let's go. Oh. Oh. Hello. And then now we're in the void. Oh, there's got to be something back there. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Oh, let's go. Gonna... Let's try to dive back in. Let's see yeah. if we can get anywhere. Okay, just rain just a little bit better. Okay. It's just totally dark, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah. We're not really going very far. Damn. Wonder if there are more caves? Yeah. Although, man, come on. Fuck you. You broke the broke the rule of putting stuff behind waterfalls. Ooh. Ooh uh, there like someone we could grab down there. Yeah, like, go, go, go. Oh, yeah. 
What's the grab button? Y, I assume. Circle. Oh, there's just a big fucking hole right there. Go yeah. up and go back down in that hole. <laughs> oh, oh, it's not really that big a hole. Is he fixing his trunks? He's fixing it, yeah, when I, whenever I try and pick something up, th there's nothing to pick up. You just kind of adjust his pants. Okay, go up. You're gonna die. Can we go around the other side of the pier? Like, how far does this fucking area go? Let's find out. Because this is the far side of the pier. Oh, it goes climb out. That's cool. Oh. Nice. There, there's a weird fish. Good luck. Come on, weird fish. It's all rumble based, so I can't tell if anything's I working know. or not ever. <laughs> Come on, weird fish. Go back over, go back over, yeah, go back over this way. Yeah, you see it. They're making a dance. Oh, got something, but not the weird fish. Oh. They got a Whoa. big fin reef squid. We're keeping that one. There we are. Uh, guess you could dive back in? Uh, no. I don't oh, think okay. so. That cave not leading anywhere was kind of a bummer. So yeah. we'll just keep running around. What if we go down on the rocks? Where does that lead us? Oh, yeah, that's a good question. Oh, this is where, like, the, the, the like, dry dock boat is and stuff. I oh, think. right, right, right. So we're close to home. Yeah. Let me talk to our weird uncle. He's sitting over here being a bum. Uh, yeah, uh, yeah, actually. Yeah, actually. Yeah, actually. Yeah, actually. Yeah, well then. <laughs> He's chilling. Yeah. That's probably good. Wash the harbor water off of ourselves. Yeah. Hmm. What if dinner's being cooked yet? I don't know what time it is. Yeah, I was gonna say. It is. Oh, it's like two thirty. Yeah. Man, day stretches on forever. It really does. Oh, Battleship Yamato model, model <laughs> kit. Well, damn. We can't afford that. We're going to have to give a lot of massages. Yeah. <laughs> oh, man. Then we can stand with our uncle on the pier and all sing the Battleship Yamato theme song. It'll be great. Oh, my God. <laughs> Incredible. Um...
Hmm. I don't really know what we get. We can do. Oh, yeah, I'm just thinking. I mean, there's always stuff to do, but like, unless we want to just like forge for better, bigger bugs. That's you like the what? one thing I really think we need to do. Yeah, I was actually curious about. Um... Oh, we left our bike. <laughs> yeah, our bikes for the clinic. That's funny. Um, I want to go see the if the rocket guy ever showed up oh yeah Cause she was like he's gonna he'll show up and you know, I'll get in, it'll be okay. weird and awkward for me uh, um yeah this not way. this way Bum, 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 bum. I mean, you know, today we were supposed to have cursed luck, but we caught, you know. Uh, this is the wrong direction. This is wrong, isn't it? No. It's the side way to the right. Like when you go down, like go down the stairs left, and then take the. Oh yeah, that's right. That's this way. Come on, weird guy, be here. I don't think he's here. No, I don't think he's here either. Also, why do you live like this? Middle schooler. Uh, he's sad that he never got to go to school with what's her face. I assume we'll just meet him eventually through the story. Yeah. It is. Should... Oh, go ahead. Oh, we should find some trees to kick. Oh, we still have some time. Yeah. Not here. They're they're going to be down their ways. Yeah, but... yeah. This one? No. No. And not down that way, because that way is the one tree we can't push yeah. over yet. Nope. Wrong button. There we go. Great oh, nice. orange tip. 110 like millimeters. battle with that guy. Right? Like, I... Not that way. Oh. Yeah, this is dead end. Well, can't we kick this one over here? Is that not a kick? No, it's the one that'll eventually fall over. But we no, haven't no, this done one. That yet. Oh, maybe. That's a no. It's not. It looked bit. No. Yatta. Oh. Medium. Well, size. now we can throw a crayfish in. We can use this bait. One of them. Again. <laughs> Go. Uh. Yeah. Down. Oh. That's not the way I meant, but oh. okay. Well, there's the tree by our house. We can just kick that tree over and over again. I don't think the, which tree we kick matters particularly. I just think we should get some. Uh... Where, where are you going? Where am I going? Yeah, no. It's You're always... going to the right. You were going the right direction. Yeah. And you just turned around and went the other way. You know. That's how you do. Yeah, around this corner yeah. uh, should be our little tree. Yeah, down this way, yeah. And past here. Fucking wake up, bugs. Can you, can you only get one a day for a tree? No. Oh, no, never mind. It's a big pissed off one, right? Let's go. 47. It's bigger, but it's still not big. It's not big, I know. We need... <laughs> Fuck this tree in particular. <laughs> we sent Boku back to his family. He just kept kicking the tree like a psycho. <laughs> it's like the good son over here. <laughs> we got the good son. <laughs> Love that movie. Wow. They're giving us nothing. And then little tree spirits come out and just like, you know, it must, it must shave not be Boku's you head. as many times as you want. Yeah. Maybe it's like one time per screen, like resets when you screen transition. Try it. Or it could just be like time based, you know, there's many ways this could go.
shaking my head. This is not getting us anywhere. No, it's not getting us anywhere. Look, we're trying to kick trees. What do you what do you want? What time is it? Okay. It's almost it's like six. five. I think we called it in six, right? Yeah, let's go let's go play the guessing what food it is game. Oh yeah. Yeah yeah. Um you go across from here, right? You know just go in the house. <sighs> and now go down. Yeah. Yeah. I think this isn't very less screen transitions. Ooh. Fish head soup, probably. Yeah, so I'm, I'm, I'm going with. We'll have to remember to ask her after dinner. Yeah. She will tell us. Let's see if we win anything. Because it definitely looks like. I mean, it's always the same animation. So. Oh, my jet side. Oh. Yeah. We had to save for the Battle Shipy motto, though. Yeah. Well, you just fucked that up. Uh, we didn't get anything. Oh. Okay, no. yeah. You know how it is. We gotta sit on things. You gotta sit and vibe. Oh, okay. Don't waste it. Yeah, no, not wasting that. We also could just be using the wrong tackle. Like, I, we have a bunch of different lures and stuff, Yeah, right? it didn't ask to, like, change it. Yeah. I was just kind of curious if we, if we could get some of the weird deep sea buddies here at all. What do we got? We got... <laughs> Tiny little Japanese whiting. Here we go. So this is oh, Sabiki. That's what he said to use. I love a Rasa. We should just uh, kind of kill time till dinner, I think. Yeah. So come and get us. Might be uh, might be time next time to bump it up to normal speed. I feel like we got a good handle on where things are. Yeah, yeah, definitely. Yeah, I, think, I don't think we're going to be going like. We're not trying to complete our compendiums and shit, you know. See if we can find more keys get stuck in. Oh yeah, just keep going. Let's see where the fucking end of this is. Oh. Oh, hello. No. Oh, no. Not a cave. Not a cave. Yeah, just keep swimming. Swim forever. <laughs> Swim forever. Uh, one time when I was in um, Barbados, I ended up snorkeling and I just kept swimming yeah, and not paying attention. I was like with like one of the other people on uh, the, the study abroad trip and like we just kept going and going and going. And then the next thing we knew it, um, this like boat had pulled up alongside of us. Oh, check there this just, little corner to your right. I, I want to see if there's another cave or something. And then we just like ran into these just national guard dudes who were pointing okay. AKs at us. <laughs> we oh, God. Like, we were like, what? What? 
And they're like, you going out so far. You need to go back. Is that a cave down there? What's oh. this? I want there to be a cave so bad. <laughs> I know. I, I, want, I want a cave for you. What? Wait, is that? Oh, no, it's not a shipwreck. I was like, damn, is that a shipwreck? We need to find this kid a shipwreck. Oh, what's that big? Oh, that's just a fish. A fish. What's, what's that big thing? Oh, fuck you. Fuck. Wait, you fish with your hands. <laughs> Wait, come back. Come back, you piece of shit. No, don't adjust your pants, kid. Is that the... Is that a... Yeah, it's a... Striped beak fish. I knew that because of Animal Crossing. Oh, yeah. Now it's now it's just pissed off. It doesn't want put something yeah. to do with us. It's fine. It's fine. What are we going to do? Swim forever is what we're going to do. We're just going to swim across this little island. We're going to swim back side. home and be like, Mom, why'd you get rid of us? Whoa. What happened? Oh, uh, oh we've seen transitioned. Holy shit. Uh, you know, keep going. Let's just keep going. Shit. Yeah. We're going to we're going to go across the entire island. Oh, look at that guy. It's an octopus. Uh, go, uh, to, to the right, directly, just like 90 degrees. I want to see if there's like a cave in here. Yeah, no, no cave. Okay. I'm just like desperate <laughs> for caves. Wait. Oh. Oh, invisible world. End of the world. This is so, I didn't expect there to be a whole other area over here. Oh, is that a puffer fish? That's the octopus still. Oh, okay. Still cool. Ah, damn. Breathe, kid, breathe. I wonder what happens if we don't breathe. We, but not enough to like ruin an entire <gasps> day. Oh, hey, fuck! Here's your shipwreck. shipwreck. Yeah, uh, breathe and then turn around and see if we can come in from there. Maybe there's like a hole in the side or something. Doesn't seem like it. There should be a way into this ship. Yeah, seriously. Oh, oh, there is. Yeah. Shit. Damn, how do I navigate around to that with this little so, weird... So, uh, swim, yeah, swim over here and then, like, go up again. Uh, yeah, I would go up. Because, yeah, oh, yeah, okay. Oh, this ends open, too. Okay. Okay. Didn't look like there was anything in there, but yeah. there's got to be. I demand it. <laughs> there's got to be something in here. Come on. Oh, there's there. There's flashing. Where? Oh, go. You, you got to get out of here. You're going to die. I know. I'm trying to. <laughs> up, up. Yeah. So when you come back around, you're going to hug the left wall and like where there's like that mid divider where it like divides the back part from the left part. When you got into that corner, a thing flashed. Okay. So hug the left wall. And then like right on top of that like box. There yeah. we go. Pick it up, kid. More Bottom. air. Yeah, more air. Oh, it refills your air too. That's Feels good. exploitable. All right, we should probably go home. <laughs> <laughs> you think? But we did find a fucking wreck ship, so that's pretty good. That's that's good. I think it's I funny because like it's, that wall. it's not gonna be like you know. Oh, it's not weird. Um, it's not gonna be like today. I found a fucking shipwreck. I wish you know? that'd be sick. I just think it's, it's it's funny that like that's how the way the game contextualizes like experiences. Yes. 
Oh, we're over here. Man, we came a long way. Yeah, wow. All right. I was just going home. We'll probably make it six o'clock. So. Say. Oh yeah, kick some fucking trees. Nope, can't kick that one. The next screen has one, I think. Oh yeah, you're right. Yeah. Kick trees. But we to did get a uncle. bug off this today, so maybe it's one bug a day if you don't do. Yep. Oh, never mind. I'm just full of shit. Big boy. Please be big. Big boy. Ah, uh, we have one that's that yeah. size already. Uh, we can exit to the right here across the hot pond. Because that'll take us to the clinic, which is open until six o'clock. So <laughs> I did write that down because the, the clinic's only up until four, but the shortcut's open until six. Yes. I wonder if. Oh, if they're still in there. Yeah, they're gone. Are you going to sit in a chair? Be the doctor. I'm the doctor now. Boo. He won't. He's respectful. Boo. I thought he was going to play with the stethoscope, but nope. What a good kid. Boku, you're a little nerd. He is a little nerd. That's great. Oh, we can grab our bike. Yeah. Is that yeah, just down the hill. Is there? Oh, yeah, I think that's a dead end. Dead. It's okay. That's the end of the world. <gasps> oh. <laughs> I was like, it's something's happening. Oh, it's like... Oh, no. Oh, I thought it was about the rice ball. おい、誰が犯人だよ。白状しろよ。お、俺当てない。僕も違うよ。おっしゃ。まあまあ。せっかくのご飯がまずくなるからあんまり深刻に考えないようにしましょう。激しか。え、ここのは俺じゃないよ
I wonder if the, the bike must be up at the hill, so we could probably bring the bike back also while we're over there. Yeah, that'd be responsible of us. I just think we'll want it again. Am I going the right then way? forget where it is. Yeah. Love to be sad and listen to jazz records. My dad left me. I honestly, it's a mood. <laughs> my dad did not like jazz, so he didn't leave me with jazz records. He left me like Lou Reed and shit. Uh, my dad did not was not a music person, but um, this this girl needs to like go to Animal Crossing. Like that's who she. That's the vibe she gives right? off. Right. Yeah. ヨモヒルマ使ったね。うん。そうだね、お姉ちゃん。ところでさ、私、ヨウくんちに行った時、おどおどしてたかな。え?どっちもなんだかよくわからないけど、どうしてそんなことを聞くの?That <laughs> is the question. Talk to her again. Don't leave without talking to her. I know. Her, I thought I thought he was going to talk to her, but no, he was being a little, a little weirdo. Here we go. Yeah, fair enough. One of these days, we're going to open that door. That's the goal. Go mend her family's schism. I wish you could get our fortune told. Yeah, we're. I mean, the bike's right up here anyway, so we might as well pop in. Mm. Everyone's wash their hair and then their faces it's the it's the hot it's the hot air like the oh, yeah. towel cool off もしかして焼き餅焼いてるのなんで光が焼き餅焼かなきゃいけないのよねえ明日はどこへ行けば面白いか占ってあげようかいやじゃあ今日は5ね1 <laughs> 2 you can pick. Hmm. Not a motherfuckers. Guess how second floor is Simon Guy I think I think Penny was the one who yeah, said, said it didn't it didn't actually matter if we said if we did all of them. Yeah. It doesn't like erase them or anything. So you just you wanna pick another one? Uh three. Medical clinic at noon. Well, we've done that. That's not anything useful. I do want to know who Nagas is trying to date. Uh-huh. We always visit Yasko. <laughs> This has been the same ones. Oh. Evening Park. Oh, we haven't been. We haven't been to I, the... I think that. I assume that means right before dinner. Because hmm. the Oscar one said night, right? Yes. Yeah. We'll do that. We can do that next week. I'll write it down. Uh, yeah. Check Park. The evening before dinner at six. Book Sugotani Kizitanda. Eh? Nanja, it to Gora. Oh. He can count his age the normal way or the non normal way. The old way. way. Yeah. All right, let's grab the bike if it's out there. Yeah. There it is. There's the ghost yeah. of the bike. We got a pet. Our boy. Kenbo. Love Kenbo. We should be able to take Kenbo out for walks and have him terrorize the brothers. God, that would be so good. We feed Kenbo pork and eel. 
And he's just like, let's go. Yeah. I'll do whatever you want. Yeah, we got crayfish. We don't need to use those for bait. We'll use those to get, feed Kembo. <laughs> Kembo. Kembo just showed up with just a mouthful of crayfish. Like, what? Oh, yeah. A big dog with a mouthful of shellfish. We're a good kid. Putting the bike back. Uh, yeah, let's go see what Simon's up to and then maybe call it. Yeah. What? Uh, no, you go through that door. Oh, I was kidding. That would actually be the best door to go into. Oh, yeah, this one works too. What time it is? Oh, yeah, it's only. Yeah. Talk to him and then probably go to bed. Oh, I want to go. I mean, we, yeah, keep going. Yeah. No, the, the, the out in the hall. No. no baths for us. <sighs> we took a shower. We did. We took a shower. We were swimming all day. It's it salt water. This is cleaning. In the harbor where the boats go. It's fine. Yeah. He's probably in the common room. Say, yeah. Simon, hey. you're not making, you're not making, uh, Pasta for 12 hours. Simon. Simon. Got a lot of favorite things, man. <laughs> oh, sick. I got a new photo. Simon, where'd you develop this? In his bedroom. He doesn't have to the studio in his bedroom, does he? Hmm. Um, we can look at our photos somewhere, right? Items? I think it's an I items. It's an items. <clears throat> photos. Like, just, yeah. There we go. <laughs> Cute. Say fuzzy pickles. Fuzzy pickles. Oh, this earthbound. All right, now it's bedtime. Now it's bedtime. What a wonderful time we've had running around a quaint little Japanese island in 1970s. Yeah. It's not brushing your teeth, but it's something, kid. Yeah, fair enough. Picture diary. I want to know what movie this poster is above the, the desk. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. There we go. <gasps> Damn. Serious. <laughs> wow. Hope she can patch things up with her old friend. Just, yeah, me too. She looks very concerned. She really does. This is a really stressful picture. <laughs> like this is the picture that gets sent you, like you sent to the, like the, the child counselor. Yeah. At least the grass is green. That 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 helps. It's, that, it's a it's a mark in your favor, kid. But you look really stressed out, and she looks like she's about to kill herself. <laughs> All right. Good night. Are we going to have another dream? Remember we dreamed of weird jellyfish yeah, last time? Yeah, the weird jellyfish dream. No, guess nope. not. I wonder if the bum, moon changes bum, from... Bum. The moon doesn't change in, in from cutscene to cutscene, does it? I don't know. I haven't noticed. I'll have to go and look back. Cause now, now I'm curious. I just, I just noticed it like... I was it's like, oh. four days, so it wouldn't change that much, right? Yeah, but like... Video games, you know. Maybe they'll make oh, it more sure. dramatic. Um, yeah, we want to save our progress. All right, let's see. There we go. Boom. Boom. We did it. All right. Not much happened, but it was still a wonderful day. That's correct. <laughs> All right. Um, so do we, want to, do we call it there? 
Yeah. Yeah, I think that's good. Yeah, next time, unless someone has a good reason why we shouldn't, we'll probably bump up the speed. Yeah. We'll, we'll maybe bump... start doing two days. We'll see how it goes, but... Yeah, I think I think we could definitely do that. Just because otherwise, we will spend the entire year playing just yes <laughs> day at a time, um, and we've got other things to play too. Yeah. Um, all right. Yeah. All right. Well, thank you for watching, everyone. <laughs> M, <laughs> where could the people find you and tell them what you've been up to? You can find me on Twitter at EM underscore being. Uh, what's up? Uh, I just put out Blockbusters. That's on a $5 Patreon tier, patreon.com slash normal mapping. We watch Stargate. Stargate's not very good. We no. barely talk about Stargate in that episode. <laughs> Oh, it's bad. We, we end up we end up talking about everything but really. And it, it opens with us talking about Sony's aging in the digital locker statement about things in the PS3 era. Uh, so that's how you, you know it's going to be a good one. Um, <laughs> Gundam is on Wednesday. We're like two episodes away from the end of Rose of Versailles. It's been very dramatic. Um, and we're wrapping up Double O Gundam, which has been a little less, more than a little less dramatic, but it's been fine. Um, Thursday, around the long fire starts Beowulf, the uh, Headley translation. That episode's already been recorded, but it will go up. Um, and we'll be recording in the one for the, for the middle part, Grendel's mother, all that stuff uh, this week. And that'll go up next week. And then on Friday, we have a big two plus hour VoIP life where we go through a sorter of weirdo video game accessories. Everything from uh, God, from the the Sega Activator to the U Brodebrand U Force to using two candles for your Wii remote, all sorts of weird shit in there. It was really funny because I was looking at that and I was just thinking, I'm just like, I'm just like the number of things on there that I'm just like, um, because of my access as a child to like really spoiled rich white kids. Yeah. Like I had done so much of that early shit on there. Like the activator. Like you've never fucked with an activator, have you? I've seen someone use an activator once. I tell the story. I as a kid, someone had one and I saw them use it and I go, I went, I don't have to use that thing. That looks like dog shit. <laughs> we, we, we one of the, one of our kids, his dad owned like three like car dealerships. Mm -hmm. And so he had all the shit, right? We, we The kids I grew up with, one owned three car dealerships that were all luxury car dealerships. Um, and the other one was like a diamond importer. So like between the two of them, they had all of this shit. And mm -hmm. so it was just like going to his house and just like using the activator and just being like, yeah, this sucks. And then yeah. like him being like, no, no, you're just doing it wrong. And we're like, no, this sucks. This sucks and no games work for it. And that was the ultimate thing. Uh, no games fucking worked for it. Yeah. But it was really funny watching kids try and play Street Fighter by like punching and kicking through it and just being like, the game doesn't recognize this. Yeah. Now uh, playing Rad Racer fun. with the with the power glove though, that was sick. I've never actually used a power glove. <gasps> it seems like a piece of shit, also. It, it I'm gonna be honest with you. Like honestly, like it, like the only games that ever like worked with it for me were Gyrus and um, Rad Racer, and those are extremely straightforward games. Like Rad Racer, you don't even do anything with it; you just kind of hold your hand there and just move it from side. Like you know, you move your hands a little bit. Um, and, and Gyrus, Gyrus was like at least kind of cool because you kind of like swoop. You're like you kind of you, you kind of did like a Tom Cruise and Minority Report sort of dealy, and then mm -hmm. like tapped your fingers to shoot. And that was kind of neat, but our power gloves, dog shit. Um, but we don't get the Wii without the power gloves. So, you know. Yeah, fair enough. You got to start somewhere. But um, no, the power glove for me was turning that into a very rudimentary uh, VR interface one summer with my stepfather. And um, that was just the most frustrating thing. And that absolutely cured me of any interest in VR ever again. <laughs> like when people talk about like VR now, I'm just like, no, you didn't spend, you didn't build a headset. You didn't build, you didn't like, you know, wire your power glove to the fucking serial port on your computer and then realize, oh, virtual reality is actually a joke. This is, this is all a lie from nerd to think they're going to like be able to like fuck Shannon Tweed in cyberspace. Yeah. And you can't. You can't fuck Shannon Tweed in cyberspace no matter how hard you try. 
I don't have any context for anything you're talking about here. I'm going to be honest with you. <laughs> you know Shannon Tweet is? God. I mean, I kind of know who Shannon Tweet is, but I'm like, what does this have to do with anything? What's I, going on? Yeah. Yeah. It has nothing to do with anything. Um, wow. That's an exciting week. I'm very excited to listen to new blockbusters, though, because um, it's, it's always, already out. You can do that whenever you I want. Know. I know. I didn't realize it was already out. I'm so excited. Like I'm like, I'm like I've got a pile of dishes like ahead of me, and I'm just like, oh, I can listen to fucking blockbusters. It rules. Yep. Uh, if you're uh, not subscribed, you should go subscribe right now. Um, if, if you're like, if you're like, I don't give a shit about Stargate. Next month, we are covering Kingdom of Heaven, the director's cut, which neither of us have seen. So, oh shit! Have you ever seen the the original? <laughs> No, I've, I, I totally missed it. The summer it came out, I was like a huge Troy stan. I mean, this comes up all the time. I love Troy, the movie Troy with uh, Brad Pitt. Yeah. And I was like, I'm not going to see Kingdom of Heaven because nobody, long, no, everyone th- thought Troy was bad. And I was very mad about it. These are the things that happen when you're fucking 18. <laughs> <laughs> well, you, okay, you dodged a bullet by not seeing the original, I think. Um, I Of course, I saw it with my dad because we saw all of the Ridley Scott uh, period epics together. Mm-hmm. Um like that was like that was the last time I was actually in a movie theater. But um, yeah, no, uh, God, I'm so excited for you to watch Kingdom of Heaven because that movie, in my mind, it fucking slaps. Yeah, everyone I know likes it. I don't I know I that like it, it holds up, but in my mind, fucking slaps. Yeah, I um, believe you. I bet it's good. Uh, yeah. So, I've been watching a lot of movies lately because I've been kind of sick and. Uh, had a weird eye injury and my doctor was like, don't read for like a week if you can help it. So, um, just been watching movies and stuff. <laughs> I like don't read translate to, I'll watch a lot of movies. Well, she she literally was like sleep or watch TV, but try not to like use the computer a bunch. Try not to do a lot of reading. Oh, it's interesting that the, 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 the distinction there, I didn't realize that was yeah a thing. Well, I think it's specifically like focusing on a lot of like tiny text was the thing she didn't want right. me to do. Yeah. That makes sense. No, um, we need prayers and thoughts and prayers for your eye. And it's fine. I think it's fine. I, I keep putting the antibiotic drops in it, but it hasn't felt weird since I got the contact lens out. So, so are you going to order the, the the Japanese menthol eye drops and try those? No, that sounds like <laughs> hell. I don't like menthol normal. I always wanted to try them, and I'm just like, but you know, when menthol, you have an eye injury, that sounds really like that. That sounds menthol, like that that'll increase your soul. I love cigarettes. I don't smoke. I, I smoke socially. Like if someone was like, oh, let's smoke some cigarettes. I'd say right now, I'd say, fuck yeah. I've never been like a habitual smoker. But um, whenever I'd bum menthols from my friends, I would be like, this is putting death into your lungs. It's way more than normal smoking. I hate menthol. Oh, see, I it's funny because I loved I loved menthol because I'm like, it's refreshing. You know what? I, yes, of course you did. Yeah, the, the no, difference here is also I'm a person of color. <laughs> <laughs> when they made when they made the the camel number nines, it had the rose oil and the menthol, and they were they came in the teal, black, and hot pink container. I've not oh, tried man. that. I would I would try it though. I would give it. Those a were shot. so good. I got the hundreds in that. I was like the ultimate Latina when I had those. And everyone... because all of my friends back when I was smoking a lot were white, it, the, the menthols were just for all the gay boys that I uh, had yeah. weird feelings for. <laughs> yeah. No. <laughs> Menthols, they're uh, for, 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 for people of color and homosexuals. Yes, um, exactly. That's correct. <laughs> but um, yeah, no, I remember the one time I offered someone, like someone like wanted to bum a cigarette for me. And I was like, I, you know, I'm like, I'm like, I'm like here you go. And he just looked at me with this look of horror that no, I see, would dare I would offer like, him a menthol. And I'm like, fuck you, buddy. I'm giving you yeah. a free cigarette no, no, in I a state complain. where cigarettes are like $13 a pack. Fuck you. I um I would say no to a clove. I really hate clove cigarettes. Um, Cause they just fucking, they're so hard to smoke. Like, I'm just like, this is gonna tear up my lungs. I don't wanna do this to myself. Um, but I do, I'll, I'll smoke a menthol. I just don't love them. I, um, I went to see Bauhaus um, in Chicago and um, I smoked an entire pack of Jarum Black. Uh, oh, I, I've look. I've had th- in my early twenties. There have been nights where I smoked most of a pack of Jarum Black. Don't live like this, <laughs> no, it's, it's, kids. If you're listening, it, it's fine if you want to smoke. It's fine if you want to smoke cloves. Do not smoke an entire Jarum Black pack of Jarum Blacks in one sitting, especially because this was before they um, regulated them. Mm-hmm. So it was like a 20 pack, like not oh, like God. the the little like seven pack or whatever the fuck bullshit Obama yeah. regulated them down to. 
Um, I mean, the cigarettes I like don't—they don't even make them anymore. I like uh, Nat Sherman ovals, like unfiltered, just fucking tobacco in a tube. My um, my uh, college advisor and Shakespeare professor, who is a, an old West, Midwestern man, um, he was, yeah, he's incredible. Uh, but he he used to smoke in his office back when you could smoke in your office. Or yeah. you could, when you quote unquote, when you could smoke in your office, uh, he got away with it because the department depended on him for everything. But um, uh, he he smoked just like Camel Blues, just because it was what he could get, or Marlboro mm-hmm. Reds, because it was what he could get. And uh, one day I found unfiltered Camels, and oh. he had gotten sick, and he had horrible like <laughs> laryngitis. Um, he did not, of course, stop smoking. So I went and I bought him a bottle of Doers, and I bought. Him two packs of unfiltered camels and Incredible. put them in a gift bag with a get well card <laughs> on his door Incredible. and i got there is this one other there's this one other professor who is in head of the writing program and she sent me the most angry letter i have ever received in my entire life um for why would you do this the man is he's he's old he's sick and you're going to kill him you know by giving him this and nick and then i got the letter from him and he was just like damn thank you this is the most thoughtful gift i've ever gotten (laughs) yeah absolutely yeah no it was just he's old he's sick let him fucking drink and smoke yeah no i hope i hope someday they the two of them hook up they deserve each other we used to fight. We used to fight over our time with Nick together. It was it was uh, brutal. College. Don't smoke. This is the lesson. Don't smoke, kids. Or do, but make sure you yeah. commit one way or the other. You can't waffle about this shit. You either. Need I, to... I mean, I, I guess I waffle. I, I don't. I don't actually smoke. Yeah. Uh, yeah see, don't be like him. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> don't be like me. It's really good that I don't because like. I like I like I said I don't smoke very often. Uh, usually in social situations, I'll go get a cigar every couple of months or whatever. Um, I like cigars, but um, if I buy a pack of cigarettes, I'm smoking the whole fucking pack. There's like no stopping. Uh, this was before my ADHD medication. I bet I might slow down a little bit these days. Um, but man, I fucking love a nicotine buzz. You kidding me? Greatest feeling on earth. No, oh, I used to write so much more. Are you kidding me? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> don't was... like weed. Don't really like alcohol. But I'll fucking smoke a pack of cigarettes and feel great. <laughs> Um, I got nothing. Uh, this week, I will probably be. My, I will probably have an article going up on Paste um, about the twelve games that you should uh, play if you are stuck in a nineteen nineties bowling alley. Oh, yeah, it's fun. Um, I get. To, God, I got, what were my bowling alley games of choice? Uh, a golden is, tea. I'll always play golden tea. Golden tea. Interesting. I yeah. forgot about that. What's a good? It's a good one. <laughs> um. I never really liked the gun games, like the shooters. Never was super into those. Yeah. Um, my barber shop as a kid, because my dad uh, was in the military, like retired Air Force. <laughs> so we, we we as a kid, we get our uh, haircuts on base. And right outside of the barber shop was a fucking uh, Arkanoid cabinet that I think of as like the arcade cabinet of my childhood. It's so funny because I almost extended this to thirteen and put Arkanoid on there. <laughs> <laughs> but I kept, I couldn't get, I couldn't find a way to write about Arkanoid without writing about the way in which I came to Arkanoid, which was at the, um, f- the then future son of the, the, the then son of the future governor of Virginia's birthday party, okay. um, where, um, his family couldn't. They couldn't book a real bowling alley. So they booked this garbage bullshit like hole in the wall one. Mm-hmm. And we never let him live it down. Um, okay. Because it was just like it was like the most cursed fucking place in the middle of nowhere. And like they didn't have like a bar for the adults. They had like a, a just a cooler like a like a like a, a you know, just one of those big like thermos brand cool like red you know igloo coolers full of like you know cans of beer and like the adults were just getting drunk and i just went into the back corner and i found this like shitty arkanoid cabinet and was just like i'm just gonna play this fuck everyone here um and he had a meltdown at one point um so i'm gonna i'm just gonna leave that story here rather than publish the actual official 
professional website. Um, so if you've made it this far, you get to hear about the time that uh, former Governor Gilmore's son, his oldest son, um, had a meltdown at his birthday party. Allegedly. Allegedly. Um, yeah. He also allegedly like attacked me with a tennis racket when I beat the shit out of him at tennis one day. Okay. Yeah. It's amazing you aren't like a terrorist, honestly, with all your childhood stories. My childhood stories are great. No one should like. It's so funny. Like you know, I just like I they're just about, all like full of the most cartoonishly evil people I've ever heard described. Because I went to a school where people used to own people. Yeah. No, I know. I understand like, how this happens. I just don't. I just don't understand how you're so good tempered. <laughs> Because my parents were normal. Well, my, my yeah. parents were normal, but like comparatively, like you know. Yeah, um, I know. You know that, that's how. That's how my parents didn't own people. That's true. Um, you know, they just had kids to torture. <laughs> Uh, yeah. Uh, so yeah, look, look forward to that this week. It's fun. Um, I had a lot of fun. I had a, fun, a lot of fun whittling down the article, the, the, the list for that, because my long list was actually surprisingly long. Cause I spent a lot of time at bowling alleys as a kid. Okay. Uh, and like bowling alleys are really weird places for, for video game arcades. Yeah. Um, I was, I was like, I bowled as a kid. Like I was in like a little like kid league. Um, and so when I was at the bowling alley, I was fucking bowling. Yeah, it was also really fun to like write about, uh, you know, the the how bowling alleys kind of came to be and like the 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 shift in them, like where they became they went from like, you know, nightmare men's clubs into like these kind of family friendly places that still tried to cater to men who wanted to bowl professionally because they believed in bowling and then yeah. also like guys who wanted like ditch their family and smoke and drink and do a man activity and then also we need to have family shit yeah they're weird um but yeah so so look forward to that also i'm going to be starting um the dragon's dogma review any day now so um that's going to be my my time have but, you built a character in the character creator? No, I refuse. That's the okay. I don't I don't believe in the the, the pre character creator thing. Like I mean, I, even though you're just gonna make Booty Bandit, we all know how it's gonna go. I, so. well, yeah, I mean, I'm, the thing is, I you know I said the thing is, like, do I make Booty Bandit for the review? I don't know. Oh, I don't think so. Yeah. I think I make a, I think I make a new character for the review. Uh, Lady Omelet will definitely be the pawn there, just so I can send Lady Omelet out into the the PlayStation Network and have mm -hmm. her available. But, um, yeah, I don't think, I don't think, uh, I don't think Booty Bat's going to be the review character. We'll see. Okay. Cause I, cause as soon as, as soon as that game drops the 22nd, we're, we're doing it. Uh, we're gonna, we're gonna start the Dragon's Dogma 2 let's play. Uh, go with God. I'm not joining anyone this time. I'm burnt out on open world video games, uh, after playing Rebirth nonstop for a week and a half. So. No, you just get to chill out and you get to watch Booty Bandit. Yep. That's, that's what that, everyone keeps like being like, oh, I'm going to play it this time. And I'm like, why? You just watch Booty Bandit. We're going to throw throw cops off cliffs. There's an elf that I've like, I've put a, a mark on already. Like they, they were, they were teasing this one elf boy. And I'm just like, no, fucker's dying. There's many, there's much podcast uh, evidence about how I feel about elves. So fucking toss that elf <laughs> off a cliff. <laughs> yeah. I'm very interested to see how they influence, like introduce these other like beastmen races and things like that. So. Yeah. So look forward to all of that in the coming weeks. Um, but otherwise, go subscribe to Normal Mapping and go listen to all their good pods because they're real good. Like, we I do can't... our best. Yeah. No, you guys are like just really just constantly kicking it out of the park. And uh, we salute you. Even when you are both exhausted and you uh, hate Gundam Seed, you still put out uh, quality podcasts. Uh, don't talk to me about Gundam Seed. <laughs> can't, the can't fuck? yeah no seed freedom will happen soon enough not to me it's gonna be another four years before i watch that fucking shit <laughs> it'd be a different m yeah all right thanks for watching everyone we'll see you next week uh and maybe we'll kick the speed up more yeah yeah till then bye bye Yay, we did it. Yeah. 
exit and save state. I really, I love that. 